Hey, Gemini. This is your reading for the week. Happy hump day. How is your Wednesday going? I wanted to be on here earlier, but you know, things change. But I'm here now. Ooh. Your first card is you moved on. So maybe um, someone is asking the question or possibly you actually just moved on or maybe you're inquiring about someone to see if they moved on from you, okay? Let's go ahead and uh, let's go put some tarot on. Let's pull your energy. And look, you got the nine of cups when I split the deck. So wish fulfillment. Mm. Holy Spirit, angels, ancestors, and guides. What is the message for Gemini? What is the message for Gemini, Holy Spirit? What's the message for Gemini? You have the Ten of Cups. Okay. So maybe you moved on to a happy family situation, or maybe you're just happy within your family dynamics. You have the strength card <clears throat> along with the judgment card. So maybe you are aligned um, you're aligned or maybe you're having like fulfillment within your relationships right um you have compassion um you've been focusing and judgment actually has been called on your situation to where you're entering into a new phase which you'll possibly receive public recognition um what is up with that public recognition though like i'm i'm curious what's going on with the judgment card What's going on with all these cards? So with the judgment card is the king of swords. Possibly um, your situation. Ooh, you got the king of swords along with the seven of swords. The five of pentacles and the six of pentacles. So something had progressed. As far as, like, maybe your person uh, decided to finally tell the truth or some truth was uh, shared with you about maybe some betrayal, the fact that uh, now they're suffering from financial loss, you're no longer giving to them, um, and they might be coming back asking for maybe a handout or assistance, financial assistance. Someone is in the Eight of Swords energy. They're having a negative, like their their mind is not, it's not all there. They're thinking negative. Is I want to know who is thinking negative. Is this Gemini or is this uh, the other person, Holy Spirit? Who is thinking negative? Who, like, what's going on with this whole situation? It was a heartbreak. Somebody might betray you with the third party situation and they were given to others. And you, I guess you took your power back, you moved on. You had the strength to like, just leave them alone. And the, no sooner you left them alone, that's when I guess judgment was being called on them. This person has not been able to sleep them night. They have been up all night, suffering from anxiety and depression. The fact that you've left them, the fact that you've elevated. No sooner you left them alone, it's like everything, your wish fulfillment, like that was, remember when I split the deck, that was the opening energy. You moved on and then you moving on. It's like, you might be, an influencer or you might be 
Um, even if you're not an influencer, you're receiving public recognition. So maybe a promotion within your company, maybe you're receiving some type of um, just notoriety about your skill set and how just amazing you are. So Gemini, this person is actually thinking about, they're thinking about um, possibly a reunion with you. They want to unify love, the two of cups. Um, I don't know, how how is Gemini feeling about this? Is Gemini, is this your situation? Ooh. There might be a phone call or a text message that you might be receiving very, like, very fast. And I, I feel like it's fast energy. They're coming in with fast, fast energy, Gemini. Um, you possibly might be dealing with a Pisces, Leo, uh, Taurus, Aquarius, uh, Cancer, Gemini, Leo, Libra, Gemini, so far, you might be having, you might, it, it might be someone who embodies those signs, whether it is sun, moon, or rising, or their Venus, or Mars placement, so what is the message, Holy Spirit? Okay, it's a couple of cards. So pretty much, this was a painful ending. You have the Ten of Swords. It might be communicating that how they were holding on to um, not really giving to you. They were, they were holding on to the fact of maybe giving their money to somebody else, not properly like treating you the way you needed to be treated. And the fact that Holy Spirit had to balance this situation. Holy Spirit had to go ahead and not only are you protected, but give you truth, right? And you moved on. You went ahead and left that situation. You transitioned. You released that baggage of that person. Because not only did they have nothing but secrets, they had plenty of options. But they didn't realize that the option that was the main, the person who they really needed to stick with was you, Gemini. Like, they didn't see that till you left them. And, and I guess they thought that maybe you want to leave. I don't know. Let's see what this person has to say, Gemini. Let's, let's go ahead and have a conversation or let's see what they want to say to you. But maybe... I'm, I feel like this was maybe a happy family situation, but you had to leave the situation because it wasn't conducive to your mental health. So let's see what this person said. Okay, so the first card that popped out, I've been watching your socials and admiring your pictures. Ooh, you got a little sparkle in your hands. <laughs> I'm just playing. But no, they've been watching you though. They said it, not me. What else do you want to... I'm sorry I hurt you. I didn't realize what I had until it was gone. Confirmation. I sabotaged our connection because it was too intense. My Lord, like, why do people sabotage stuff, good things? And that's the crazy, like... <sighs> Don't sabotage. Just be good. You know, do what you got to do. Okay, Holy Spirit, what is the message? What's the love message for Gemini to close this reading out? What is the love message for Gemini to close this reading? Holy Spirit, what is the message for Gemini? Okay, Gemini, so your love message is keep the door, yeah, keep the door open. Don't be so focused on a closed door that you don't see the ones that, which is open for you. Okay, Gemini, so that has been your energy read for the week. I'm sending you lots of love, peace, 